Hey guys, today we're gonna talk about the Donner Ultimate Comp. This is a compressor guitar pedal uh, in a miniature form factor made by Donner, which is a, a very value-oriented brand. Now, if looking at the face of this, this is a miniature size pedal, so it's very small, and it's gonna save you a lot of room on your pedal board. Uh, what sets this pedal apart from other pedals is the controls that it has on board. So, as you can see, foot switch, indicator lights. We have a main knob here, which will be for the compression itself. We have a level knob, which will be for your overall output and volume. And we have a toggle switch here for normal or treble, and we have a tone knob. Now what sets this compressor apart from other pedals would be the fact that you can actually shape your tone with it. So already it makes for a pretty excellent compressor and I have it set to a very neutral setting where it's not going to color my tone. Now what makes this pedal great is that you can actually turn the tone up and dial in more treble and take out some of the bass or you can use the, the, the switch up here, normal or treble, to go ahead and go for a more bright end of things. Uh, how this could help is that this can really help your, your, I guess your clean sound really stick out in the middle of a mix. If you're playing in a band with a lot of different instruments and a lot of instruments that sit in the same kind of uh, frequency spectrum that the guitar does, this is a really good way to really cut through and be heard. I'm gonna go ahead and show you my clean tone without the compressor, and then we're gonna turn it on so you can hear it. So this is my Strat going through my Mesa Boogie Electrodyne on the clean channel. <laughs> Now this is it with the Donner Ultimate Comp. As you can hear, it's a very nice compression. Uh, it doesn't get super squishy. It sounds like the attack on this compressor is really quick. It tends to um, react very, very quickly to my inputs. So if you listen, it's not super squishy. I feel, I feel like the squish hits really fast to where you can't even notice it. That's a pretty fast attack, and I have it set pretty high. So I'd say that's actually a really, really appealing feature of this because it makes it sound almost like you don't have a compressor on, and that's actually a really redeeming quality of it. I think, I think that's lovely. I can dial the compression back and show you how that sounds. Sounds like we don't even have compression, so that's probably too subtle. Now let's try cranking it to the max and hear how that sound. It's pretty squishy, but once again, you don't hear that initial squish because the attack is actually really quick on this thing. Now what's really cool is that you can crank up the tone knob here and you can get a lot more top end out of this. Crank it up some more. That really took a lot of the low end out of my guitar and really gave me a lot more presence. Um, that's a really, really neat feature because a lot of compressors just don't have that. So very, very nice touch downer. I think that's a really, really neat professional tool to have. And then uh, I'm still trying to figure out exactly what this switch up top does between normal or treble. So let's just go ahead and listen. We'll find out together. So this is normal. Now let's try it in treble mode. Once again, just like turning that tone knob, that took a lot of the bass out and really made the high end really, really speak. So, I mean, that's absolutely stellar. And another feature of this that I really like is that uh, I have the level turned at right under noon. Um, you can crank this higher and even get even more headroom out of your amp. So this also makes a really cool clean boost because, you know, if, let's say you have a clean solo coming up in a song, you can go ahead and stomp on this 
and make yourself heard really, really easily. So let me show you just how much headroom I can get out of this. I'm gonna try not to blow the mic out right now. And Max, let's hope it doesn't clip. Okay, that's pretty loud, so I'm gonna turn it back down. But yeah, that's absolutely stellar. Um, on top of that, it's a true bypass pedal, so it's not gonna color your tone when you turn it off. So really, really neat. Um, Donner did an excellent job on this. I think that this has its own kind of corner of the market. If you know other compressors that let you shape the tone like this and let you EQ it, uh, please feel free to comment below. Uh, this is my first time running into a compressor like this uh, where you get to adjust these kinds of parameters. So anyway, thank you so much for listening. I hope you all enjoyed that. And if you're looking for a compressor at a very friendly price, or if you just want a compressor that can work as a clean boost, or that can really make your clean solo stand out, absolutely check this out. This is very cool.